Why, hello, 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 hello. We've got fairies. We've got some fairies. I think this is the one we use. You the Zelda's lullaby? Not the, not the one of time. Zelda's lullaby, right? I should get my fairy out. Oh, here she comes. Oh, this beautiful, beautiful lady. Oh. When I was little, that was a, that was a sight to see. <laughs> Welcome. Next, hold on. Welcome, Bluff. I'm the great fairy of power. I'm gonna grant you a sword technique. Receive it now. <laughs> what am I receiving? Receive me. <laughs> okay. Whoa. What did I get? Spin attack. Hold B to charge your weapon. Release B to unleash a wave of energy with your spin. And if you want to release energy without charging your weapon, just rotate once and press B for a very effective quick spin. When you charge a power for a spin attack, Magic power be consumed. Pay attention to the green magic meter. Hey boy, you're a passenger for the royal family. Next time you're in the neighborhood, you should drop in a friend of mine who lives by Iru Castle. She'll surely grant you another new power. <laughs> when battle has made you weary, please come back swimming. God, that screech. Sheesh, woman. Well, let's see, uh, let's, um, we'll ride you down, sir. Hoot, 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 hoot! There we go. Whoa! Another awesome 3D effect that's never been seen before in the history of all 3D effects done on the Nintendo 64. Yeah, I went there. Why are we going backwards? Fly in a straight line! Now I know why Gandalf didn't take the frickin' eagles. They don't fucking fly straight. <laughs> Wait. There's something I can do up here. Yep. I remember it now. It's fall down right here. So I can go in here. Ha 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 ha. piece! Cows. Dang cows. Woo! Okay. Let's go to town, fellas. Wait a second. I saw that. I saw that. I saw that. You ain't jipping on me. How much do I have to get until I get to the next one? Can't be far away, because I mean, like, I got a lot when I was in there the other day, like, in the temple. So I've got one. So how many more do I need? Let's ask this fella. You are getting cursed. Okay, cool. How about uh, talk to middle guy? See if he can tell me. Look like this because of blah blah blah. Spiders curse, but blah 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 blah. Since you destroyed 14 spiders, the curse. The curse is starting to weaken. Did the kids who returned to normal give you anything? Okay, you should know that the only way to become very rich is to destroy as many spiders as the curse as possible. Okay. There are some tricks to finding them. First of all, you'll have to hunt and blah, blah, blah. I guess it doesn't really say. I'm guessing it's like every like five, I mean 10, I mean. So I need like another seven in order to get any. Right? I think so. Yeah, that one don't break. Thought so. Thought so. Thought so, Huggin' Bear. Wow, I'm dumb. <laughs> okay. Let's head on out of here. Let's check out some stuff here. So let's head on into town. Oh shoot. Ignore the frickin' skellies. No point in wasting your time on those suckers. 
Whoa, that moon is fast. Look how fast that moon is going. You probably, you practically can feel the breeze on your face. It's that bad. Okay, come on. Come on. Bring that gate down. Don't got all day. Even though the day is approximately like 12 minutes. I don't remember how long it is. It's pretty short. Okay. So let's head on in here. Well, first off, let's get some let's get some coins. Get some coins. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. So now we can hold up to 200 coins. That's a lot of coins. It's coins for days, man. Blue coin. There we go. Oh, shoot. Come on. Just let me hit it. Hit it. I think pretty much all these are empty, though, over here, I think. There we go. Let's try this side. There we go. We got another blue one. That's not bad. So help me if all these are empty. Oh my god, they were. Well, that was worthless. Worthless. Okay. Here we go. Heading on out. Moving on up to the east side. East side of what? Don't ask me any questions. It's not there. So, we had the great fairy tell us about the other great fairy. So, why don't we go talk to that other great fairy, too, while we're at it? Let's, uh, get the great mask shop, too. Because, uh, he's a thing. Hi! Welcome to the happy mask shop. We deal with masks and bring you things. How would you like to buy a happy mask salesman to lend you a mask? You sell the mask and bring your money back here. He actually does pyramid scheme, basically, at that point. If you read the fine print, take a look at the sign right over there. He have to lay so the mask. You'll become happy yourself. Have faith. Well, let's grab this guy for now. I'm pretty sure I know where that goes. It's supposed to go to the guy that uh, goes up to Death Mountain. I think that's where I, uh, last time I remembered it. So we're not going back there anytime soon. Let's go quickly find that fairy. Which I know she's on the other side of this wall. So let's uh, start climbing here. Do a hop, skip, jump here across the way. She's over. She's not down there. I forgot where she is. She's like over there, isn't she? She's over here somewhere. Where in the world is she again? I forgot. Let's head on out here quick. She's over here somewhere. This is to the forest, but I'll break it anyway, right? Dead end. Nah, <laughs> guess what? Now it's not. What the world? What is this way again? I think this goes back to the... Nope, this is the fairy. Okay, never mind. This is the fairy, guys. Two fairies in one episode? What am I doing to you? I'm spoiling you guys rotten. That's what I'm doing. Spoiling you guys rotten. <laughs> oh boy, here she comes. Oh, there she is. This one lays sideways, all seductive like. Oh, and we get a little peruse of her body. Mm. Oh, shoot. I found the pretty lady right there. <laughs> Welcome, please. I'm the great fairy of magic. I will give you a magic spell. Please take it. <laughs> Whoa. That, that, uh, that pose, lady. Back off. Back off. I am only 10. <gasps> You've got Din's fire. Cool. Din's fire. Jin's fire? You can use Din's fire, but not only to attack but also to burn things. When battle has made you weary, please come back to see me. Sheesh. Lady. Calm.
just realized we also already just got all three of the uh, bottles already. Nice. Nice. I was kind of like worried I would have to try and find them all. No, we did pretty good. We knew what we were doing. We knew what we were doing. Okay. So now, gosh, so much stuff that's being done in this episode, guys. First, I go ahead and I got these fairies, went into the happy mash shop. Now we're going to the temple of time. Oh my gosh, this is a packed episode with so much stuff going on. So quiet. Let's go inside. Okay. We need to lay down. We need to lay down our uh, our odds and knickknacks and things we obtained. So it's uh. There we go. There are three hollows and an inscription here. Ye who owns three spirit stones stands with the ocarina of time and play the song of time. This is how the inscription reads. Fine. Play that song of time then for you. Oh shoot, messed up. I think it's, eh, uh, 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 that's it. Nailed it. What's gonna happen? <gasps> you know, and since I'm, uh, this is so old and I've already played this and I'm pretty sure everyone else has played this. You know what would have you know stopped this? If you never would have gotten the spiritual stones in the first place. No, that's what happened. But because he opened the damn door, it's all his fault. All Link's fault. Yep. Doing it because a girl told you to do it. What's a frick? Oh, gosh. Wow. Isn't that? Oh, boy. What is it? It's the legendary blade. <laughs> the after sword. Sheesh. Should we grab it? Should we grab it? You know what? We've done a lot in this episode. We're not gonna grab it. And for some reason, it is floating off the pedestal. This side, fine. Other side, not so much. <laughs> anyway, what we'll do is we'll stop it here. We'll see you guys all next time. Uh, like, comment, subscribe so we can see what's gonna happen when I pull the master sword out of the sky.